Hi, and welcome to another Lure Fishing for Us UK video. Uh, well, today, as you can see, uh, it is a, a reel again. So this is the Shimano uh, Twin Power SW4000XGC. Um, I've added a reel stand to my reel because when I tend to take pictures of fish, I put the rod and reel down like that, and I don't want the reel to get scratched or damaged. So um very very nice reel this is one that i wanted to upgrade um to for a while now i've had a stradic 5000 which has been a fantastic reel uh, but this is just taking it to a next next level the stradic smooth this is just ridiculously smooth um it doesn't have a line clip on the spool um which the stradic has there it doesn't have that kind of a line clip um but it does come with a spool band um one of my concerns with this reel um uh, before i actually uh, pressed the button and bought it was the fact of the elephant in the room this huge handle knob <laughs> um, this handle knob is 44 millimeters um in diameter which is pretty big if you then look at the um the Stradix one, which is only 36 mil, so you can see there's a big, big difference. So what I might do, time will tell, um, I might well um, use a Gamexus. This is a Gamexus um, EVA knob that's 38 mil, which is a far more sensible size. For the type of fishing I do, I think that would make sense. Um, but yes, the reel is really, really nice. It's something I, <clears throat> I've wanted to upgrade to for a while. Um, this one came came available, and yeah, I went for it straight away, as you can see. Um, differences... If I just hold you up the Stradic, so that the body is slightly bigger, not a huge amount, but it is slightly bigger. Um, spec wise, uh, on this, um, this has got a six to one gear ratio, just like the uh, the Stradic 5000 has. Um, it's got um, 24 pounds of drag or 11 kilos, yet again, same as the Stradic probably a bit more i would guess on this um it does weigh a little bit more this weighs um uh, 350 grams or 12 ounces opposed to the stradic being 295 or 10.4 grams i'm not bothered about weight of reels um i like the reel to actually help balance my rod um so if it's slightly heavy it's going to make the balance more sort of directly in my hand to give me a slightly tip up angle which is how i fish so that that's great for me um it's got nine nine plus one bearings um, it will take, um, when you retrieve, it will bring in 101 centimetres of lime, just as a Stradic would. Um, interestingly, the Stradic 5000, um, when I spooled that up, um, I then literally took the, the braid straight off that. This is a Tasline Elite 1.P, 1.7. Um, so from a 5000 um, Stradic onto a 4000 Twin Power, it took exactly the same amount of line. So that was um, useful to know. Um, it does have... A manual trip not that i'll ever use it as a manual trip it will only have a drag clicker going out it won't have one going in um and just the usual shimano quality um obviously you, it's got x protect and x ship and hagana gears and bodies and, and all the other stuff you can look that up online if you need to know or, or ask me below and I'll, and I'll do my best to answer for you um <clears throat> some people have said it's got a metal body uh sorry it's um a ci4 body but uh, no, according to, to Shimano's website, it has a magnesium or uh, aluminium body. So luckily, again, there's no plastic. Personally, I don't like plastic or, or CI4 reels because I find they can give a little bit when you're really giving a fish some beans and you, you can get a little bit of flex, I find, and sort of it usually be in the stem. Not much, but I, I can find it. And it's something I, I personally don't like, hence me going down this route. So um, that's the end of this video. If you have enjoyed the video, please do give me a thumbs up. If you've got any comments, please do ask them below. And please do subscribe to the channel. Many thanks. Bye now.